So I got these sponges from a small Irish business. I'm gonna try them out. So this is the set. <clears throat> this is not sponsored, I paid for these. They're latex free, cruelty free, and vegan free. Wow, it's so squidgy. My previous sponge is this one. Can you say hat? Very on its last legs. Rip, rip to the goat. Just talking about the Tri Channel Party vlog. It always kind of throws me a little bit. How many people don't get Irish humor? A lot of people did get it and that's good for you. <laughs> but a lot of people didn't get that we were obviously joking when we said Dermot had pissed himself. Sean even came over and said he didn't really piss himself and I said don't ruin the joke Sean and then people still thought Dermot really pissed himself. Dermot spilled whiskey on himself. If you spill drink on yourself on a night out in Ireland you'll be accused of pissing yourself. It's such a natural thing to do. People don't realise that like Irish people we're um this is so soft by the way but Irish people are just messers like we're just always joking like you can't really trust just at face value <laughs> what comes out of her mouth, you know what I mean? I'm always really surprised by accidentally misleading people because when I think like something is obviously a joke and then loads of people won't get that it's a joke. So yeah, Dermot didn't piss himself. <laughs> he just spilled whiskey very close to his crotch and we all slagged him by pissing himself because it's funny. It's the same way when you're on a night out in Ireland and somebody knocks over a drink or smashes a glass, people would cheer. <laughs> we'll cheer and sometimes we'll go, taxi! <laughs> you don't actually have to go home after you smash a glass. Like, we'll just shout taxi. It's very soft, like doing your makeup with a cloud. This can serve as a makeup tutorial actually for anyone who's interested. So what I did was I put Maybelline Perfect Match, is that Maybelline? Uh, sorry, L'Oreal. L'Oreal Perfect Match Under Eye Concealer, followed by L'Oreal Nude Match Primer. Can you see that? It's actually a plumping tinted serum. I don't wear foundation anymore. I gave up actual like full coverage foundation a couple of years ago and my skin thanks me for it. I love the word fondant as well. And it really describes how squidgy they are. But apparently these sponges have just been re-released, so the packaging is all different. And when I originally went to buy them, they had this packaging that made it look like a box of sweets. And I was actually so there for that packaging. Oh, I'm getting very excited for Streamy Berry. Last year I tried to do every day. I think this year I'm gonna do weekdays again, same as Vlogmas, I just think it's a little bit more manageable. But I'm very excited because I only just found out that Grand Theft Auto 6 is coming out. And so I am so excited for a new version to come out and to play it on stream. I can't wait. So my highlight is the collection Gorgeous Glow. I like it because I like liquid highlighter. I really want to look wet. Like I want to look like I just got out of the shower. That's my goal all the time. So I really like that kind of stuff. What I use my eyebrows is I use brow wax from Catrice and then this pencil I think is Rimmel. I'm just now realizing how disgusting my makeup looks but it's because I use it every day okay that's why. And then I use Maybelline Sky High Mascara. I have been an avid fan of this for years. So there you go that's what I look like. I think that's fine. I normally have this absolutely gorgeous spray. Can you see it? It's called Ella and Joe. Another Irish small business but it's out right now and I can't afford to get another one. So I'm using be perfect one Jew three. That's actually another Irish business. I, I don't know if it's a small business anymore, but it's definitely Irish. Every time I spray that, I'm reminded of the cinema. For whatever reason, I think that kind of smells like the cinema. I don't know what it's meant to smell like. Okay, so we are going to our tag team Christmas party. That is our sports team, not taggy red. Like, <laughs> not that kind of tag. We're watching Connacht get absolutely murdered. Like, well, they're not getting, okay, that's hard. They're not getting murdered, but they're not winning. I have no usable footage, because we've just been talking tag all night. Can you give me something from the party? Give me some good. Are you enjoying the party? Just, just entertain the American audience. Typical. Trying to think of a Star Trek reference because they really seem to enjoy the last one. Thank you, that's enough. Who is your favorite Star Trek character? There's a spot. Like with new spot and not old spot. She has no idea what I'm talking about. No, no, back to me. Back to me. No, you don't. You know, 19. Leonard Nimoy! 
Yeah. Is he the dog man? Yeah, no, I'm from the 1960s episode. Yes. I like Leonard Nimoy, but I prefer... Yes. Leonard Nimoy from probably a film in the 1990s, I'd say. Okay, can you just finish your sentence already? Yeah. My sentence is over, but I'm just going to start a new sentence. Fans love it. War. Discuss. That's it. That's it. That's going to be... Your comments are going to be absolute fire. I'm going to stop putting these in. You guys are going to stop putting these in.